Good evening, YouTubers. I thought I would share with you a little project that I've been working on. This is a model of Castle Ravenloft that I created back in 2008, um, you know, just before the Beijing Olympics. I was living there and had a bit of free time on my hands, so I just put this thing together. And um, a few, uh, about a year ago, I started doing 3D printing, and I created a printable version of this, and it turned out okay. This is what it looks like. So here is the 3D printed version of the model. Uh, it turned out okay. The detail's not all that great because I have a uh, FDM printer, and it just, you know, printing on a small scale, it doesn't do a great job, but it turned out okay now recently i got a fdm printer or a, a sla printer and i really would like to do more detail so i've been working on um, learning how to do uh, sculpting in blender so i wanted to pick up this old model that i created and start really detailing it out. And I thought I would make some videos along the way to show my progress. So I have two actual goals in mind. The first goal would be to create this model, detail it out, you know, do some texturing on it and colorization, you know, you're adding materials to make it look as photorealistic as I can. Also to add a high level of detail for printing with SLA so it would look really, really nice. That is my primary goal. Also, I would like to be able to create a version of this that could be piped into a 3D game so I could run around inside this castle. I think that'd be a lot of fun. And I, part of that work is already done because the way I created this is I started out by mapping out the inside. So here is the original uh, floor plans that I kind of laid out from the original Dungeons and Dragons map and um, then I just sort of extruded shapes around it. <clears throat> so the shapes for the rooms are there. All I really need to do is start adding in walls, floors, ceilings, etc. And as I detail all that out, I can then start texturing and create a really neat <clears throat> walkthrough. The challenge here is going to be that with 3D detail for printing, we want a different kind of detail. In 3D printing, you want triangulated meshes with a lot of detail to do SLA. Whereas with game modeling, you want a low poly model with a high res texture. So I'm going to try to produce both. Um, so we'll see how that goes. I'm still learning these processes and it's gonna be a fun little journey here and I, we will see where we end up. Of course, my primary goal is the creation of the printable, the 3D printable version. So um, I'm going to try to do that first, but um, we'll see how it all works out. So anyway, stay tuned. I'll post more videos as I make progress on my, um, my project. Enjoy. Have a good night.